Now, several weeks after the nationwide lockdown began, the Karnataka government has only now announced a detailed relief package of over 1,600 crore rupees for groups considered the worst hit. Maya Sharma joining us with details on that. Maya, what are we hearing? Well, certainly several groups being helped now by the Karnataka government. It has, of course, been many, many weeks since the lockdown started. Lots of people hit very badly economically. Immediately, flower growers will get a relief of 25,000 rupees per hectare to a maximum of one hectare. A one-time 5,000 rupee compensation for dobies and barbers, washer people and barbers who, of course, have been badly hit in the cities as well. Auto and taxi drivers who have not been able to apply They'll get a one-time relief of 5,000 rupees. Construction workers, of which, of course, there are lakhs in Bengaluru, they'll get 3,000 rupees. Now, this is in addition to 2,000 rupees announced earlier. Also, uh, handloom workers will get 2,000 rupees into their account. MSMEs, who have been suffering also, will have a two-month waiver of electricity bills, while the larger industries, they can pay their electricity bills after two months. Their bills are going to be deferred for two months. Now, of course, Kanaska has three districts still considered red zones, including the economic powerhouse of Bengaluru. So the state's revenue has taken a hit. But this package of over 1,600 crores announced now to help those really among the worst hit. Farmers, details not yet announced, but a package of relief for farmers to be coming up shortly is what the chief minister has said. But this package right now of over 1,600 crores for groups like auto drivers, taxi drivers, barbers, washermen, people who have been really hit by the lockdown and the loss in their earnings. Right, Maya. So something for everyone there, uh, electricity, bills being deferred for larger industries, MSMEs also getting a two-month waiver of electricity bills, but also perhaps most importantly for self-employed people, there seems to be at least a one-time helping hand of sorts. Uh, whether this is going to really ease their economic distress or not is, of course, the big question. But Maya, thanks for joining us with those latest details.